Hello everyone, if you want to learn how to make this atmospheric 2D game step by step, then I made a course that you could benefit from, which is currently 60% off if you buy it from the link in the description. Check out the intro. Hello everyone, in this course I will be teaching you how to build a moody atmospheric 2D game from scratch and make it go from this to this. My name is Yusuf al Sawedi. I have over 7,000 students with an average Udemy rating of 4.5. If you've ever wanted to create a, a dark, moody, atmospheric 2D game, then welcome to this course, where we'll learn how to make this 2D game using Unity and the C-Sharp programming language. This course is for beginners who are at least somewhat familiar with the basics of Unity and C-Sharp, like the different data types, bool, string, int, and float. The real basic stuff. If you already know how to use them, then you're more than ready to enroll onto this course. If you want to start making games, but don't know anything about making games, then be sure to check out my free course on how to make a, a Flappy Bird like game for Android for absolutely free. Just scroll down, go to my profile and select the free course. And this course will bring you through the entire process from making a main menu to making a detailed player controller script and making your character move in the world and interact, adding lights and 2D effects, adding collectibles and counters, learning to use the tile map editor, adding sound effects, adding animations and many many more all you can learn by enrolling onto this course and you'll have tons of fun along the way now if you're still watching but hesitant on whether you should or shouldn't enroll onto this course then i suggest having a look at my youtube channel it has a pretty good amount of free tutorials or maybe enroll onto my free udemy course which teaches you how to create a flappy bird clone for android for absolutely free Again, the links for my YouTube and free course are on my instructor profile. If you have any questions or encounter any problems while watching the course, you can easily go to the Q&A section and ask freely, and I'll respond as soon as possible. And with all that being said, I hope to see you on the other side.